District Attorney in Logan County wants an accused killer's bond revoked. Dan Trippett has been out on bond after being accused of killing his employee Brent Mack in September and burying Mack's body underneath a septic tank. News 9's Angelicia Bruton is live with more on the details in this case. Logan County District Attorney Laura Thomas filed a motion to revoke or increase Dan Triplett's bond, a man charged with first degree murder and desecration of a human corpse. Guthrie businessman Daniel Triplett was arrested in October. After Brent Mack's remains were discovered at the bottom of a septic tank, the two were hired to install. At the time, Mack's family said they were happy to get closure, but that soon turned to anger when Judge Susan Worthington granted Triplett bond at $500,000 in December. I heard her say, I'm a grant bond in the amount of $500,000. She understands that there is video evidence, and she put that up against him being an outstanding citizen in the community. District Attorney Laura Thomas recently filed a motion asking for a reconsideration. She was unable to talk to us today. According to court documents, the court ordered Triplett to only leave his home to visit his attorney, doctor appointments, and court dates. The motion states he violated that several times. It says on December 15th, the defendant visited a Waffle House in Oklahoma City, and on January 4th, he visited a convenience store and bank in Guthrie. The Guthrie Police Department reached out to the Cleveland County Court Services Program Director about his violations. The incident report quotes the program director saying, I was not aware he was going to stop anywhere on his way home, and I've directed him against it. He knows that his stop is being reported back to the DA, and he's in violation of his bond. Triplett is currently out of jail. A hearing is set for January 14th. Max's family was unable to interview with us today, but they say they're thankful that the DA is looking into revoking Triplett's bond. In Guthrie, Angelicia Bruton, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.